Omar, you were brought on board as a senior advisor for baseball operations this offseason, so you're brand new here. What, what are some of the first items on the to-do list when you come to spring training with a new team? Well, the first item, of course, is to try to learn. <laughs> be a listener, not a talker. Listen to uh, staff uh, for me to work, be able to work with Cash and work with the other guys, uh, uh, Booney and all that. Really to listen and to watch and to really as an evaluator – kind of see the system, see the players, but also how things are done. Uh, so for me, as a first year guy, you want to just learn as much as you can, especially in spring training, where you have all the whole organization together from top to bottom. The players, the major league players, the minor league players, clubhouse people. So it's more of a learn more, listen more, say, say less. Learn, observe, watch. This is, this is low-hanging fruit for me here. What are you seeing right now? Well, what I am seeing, of course, is a very, uh, a very professional, established organization that has been very successful uh, when you look at the track record as far as winning. Uh, what I'm seeing also is um, uh, a leadership group uh, from Cash, like I said, that, and Booney uh, that pretty much are focused uh, with high standards. Uh, what I'm seeing, I'm seeing a minor league system that's developing players. When you look at the Dominguez, well, when you look at the Volpes, um, you got a good blend of guys. Um, and of course, it's the brand, the Yankee brand. You know, as a, you know, growing up in New York, you know, just the impact of the brand uh, and how much that brand, uh, how much the standards are uh, when you're a Yankee, uh, the expectations are. You expect to be playing in October, and where we are right now is not only playing in October. But expect this, you know, you, you want to get to the World Series and you want to win the World Series. So um, what I'm seeing is a lot of good things. I'm seeing um, uh, good staff, uh, really uh, diverse staff uh, as far as internally, uh, a good blend of uh, um, what you call, what we call traditional baseball people, bringing Brian Savings on board, having Jim Hendry on board, uh, you know, having Tim Neri on board, and then having, uh, you know, real bright, young um data people if you want to say call the data some people call it analytics i call it smart people uh so you have a blend of that tradition with uh working together uh so to me i've seen a lot of different things and i can understand why this organization has been in the playoffs for so many years when you talk about that blend you have that scout's eye and you mentioned two prospects that people want to know a lot more information about what sticks out to you about jason dominguez and anthony volpe well, as a talent evaluator, the first thing that sticks out to me is they play in the middle of the field. You know what I'm saying? And players that, that play in the middle of the field, to me, are I love guys that play in the middle of the field. Uh, you have a lot of talent in baseball right now, you know, but get players that play in the middle of the field are able to have long careers because they'll adjust and play other, other parts of the area. To me, winning team, winning organizations, you and your talent in the middle of the field. Dominguez is a center fielder. Uh, Volpitz is a shortstop. Um, where they end up, you know, by, I think they're going to play right, right where they started. Um, but, they, but it's not only about them. You also have your other young kids uh, that are in the organization. And, uh, but those two guys stand out because of their age. Uh, they perform well. They're playing higher levels. Um, and they're baseball players. You know, one thing about Volpe is a guy that knows how to play the game. Uh, Jersey kid, I'm always going to be a little biased because being from Jersey, you're going to always be biased with those kids. But Dominguez and, of course, being Dominguez of Dominican is another thing. So <laughs> I'm in a good spot with these two guys. But it's not only about those two guys. There's other real good organ players in the organization. Yeah, there's some names on, on the upcoming for sure with the Yankees minor leagues. Omar, thanks for the time. Welcome aboard. Thank you for having me here and looking forward to it.